there was a time I enjoyed nothing more than to talk to this man, but those times have changed. But I will say this for you, Conan. Nobody gets down and dirty quite like you. Orale, Limash. Arriba la raza. Whatever. I don't care what Ted DiBiase has to say. At one time, he was at the NWO, but he did not prove his word, so he was booted out. He was kicked out. He has no say in the matter. We are the original men in black. We know what it's all about. He wants to live that dog life, that vato loco forever life, but he can't. He won't. And come Monday night, we're going to take care of business, NWO style, vato. All right, let me talk about Rowdy Roddy Piper. He did two things. First of all, he said that Hogan's going to have to face Sting, and then he put himself into a cage match against your fearless leader, Hollywood Hulk Hogan. That's going to be in Halloween Havoc. Well, Rowdy Roddy Piper, he's got a big mouth. All I can say is this, you better watch your back because WCW is not, has never been united, and never will be united. We've been intimidating you, we've been humiliating you, we just retired Ric Flair, yeah. Chris Benoit's out of circulation, and Rowdy, you're next, porque lo dice Conan. You must be loving the fact that her Kurt <laughs> Hennig is now part of the NWO. Orale, that plan had been, that plan had been seated a long time ago. You see what happens when you mess with the NWO, and you know what? Maybe Lee Marshall may be 